Hi, Mark. Thank you for taking time out of your day to answer a few questions about the online newspaper. No problem. All right, since going online, it takes time to build a newspaper, the website, and all the functions that go with it. How do you feel about the program use? Oh, program use, College Publisher 5.0. feel it's very uh, user-friendly, definitely. The, the only problem with it, uh, the only problem that we really had is having to learn the program in such a short amount of time. So uh, basically relied a lot on relied a lot on uh, our editors who were learning who were in a learning process and then having to coach and teach us through the whole thing. After learning all the different things that you can do with it, it was uh, definitely very user friendly and definitely something that I would recommend using for uh, creating an online paper. Okay, great. Now this transition from print to online, has that affected the way you write, the way you produce and edit your papers? Uh, well, this is actually my first time uh, writing any sort of newspaper articles. I took like new uh, introduction to newspaper, but that was four years ago, so it took me uh, a while to get back into the news writing scheme. Uh, so basically, um, not really anything different between how I'd write for regular print or how I'd write for uh, something going online. Basically at this point I relied a lot on my editors to help coach me through uh, my writing process, coming up with good news stories and proper news stories. Alright, well great. Well good luck with the online newspaper. Thank you for your time. Thanks. Hi Erica, thank you for taking your time out to talk about the online newspaper. You're welcome. Alright, so as this is your <coughs> first time ever writing for the newspaper, print slash online, do you find it challenging to actually do an online newspaper? Well, the challenge itself is to try to find how the system works. It's not as, you know, just having something to like write and then, you know, send it to the print machines and then get it back and everything's fine. You have to like figure out how it goes in place and the formatting and stuff itself. Do you feel going online would be more popular than the print media for the students? to uh, enjoy more? Well, I do think that online right now, the internet, it's one of the major, you know, assets for, you know, advertising or, you know, getting the name out there. So yes, I think that it is really good for our newspaper to be online so we can share it with other people, you know, around the globe easier, just emailing or anything. Okay, so in your opinion, what was the most interesting aspect of putting together this online newspaper? Well, for me, I think it was personally to see how we all worked together as a group, try to find how it worked, and going through really hard times and frustrating, you know, all of us just trying to, like, find how it worked. So maybe that, kind of like the challenge of doing it. Hi, Abby. Thank you for taking your time out to uh, answer a few questions about the online no newspaper. No problem. All right. As an editor, what do you think about the transition from the print newspaper to strictly online? Um, well, it has been a very rough transition. Um, we learned that we were transitioning to an online newspaper the first day of class, so there was really no preparation for making a smooth transition. And we then um, had to get in contact with the company that we signed a contract with that runs the software that um, puts out the paper, and we then had to learn how to use the software. And that has been a very trying experience this semester. So we've had a few roadblocks, but we've recovered from them and now we're online.